So one element of Screaming Frog that is really helpful is configuring the Google Search Console API. So you can start to blend Screaming Frog data with Search Console data. So you can not only see if there's any technical issues, you can start to see how pages are performing. So I'll do this on my website as an example. So this is the crawl of my website. So if I go to configuration, API access, Google Search Console, need to sign in. Just sign in. Continue. Okay, receive verification code. You can, and there we go. Here's the list. So select my website, click OK. And then always make sure to do this part. It really annoys me when I don't do it. Under URL inspection, click enable URL inspection. Then it'll actually crawl the pages and give you the data. If you, I normally just have past 30 days in Screaming Frog, but if you want more Search Console data, you can change this date range, add any filters you want. So I'll click OK. And then just to run the API again, request API data. So you click API in the top right, request API data. You can see Search Console straight away, progress done. Probably because mine's quite a small site. Oh. It's working now. Tease me a bit. Let's just turn the progress. So we'll start to see it fill in in the internal part. I just need to scroll across a little bit. There we go. So this is the search console data that you start to see pull in, which is really helpful to see it side by side. So you can see clicks, impressions, CTR, average position, URL inspection, which is that box that I ticked, just to make sure. URL is not on Google or URL is on Google. This is a reliable source of seeing whether a page has been indexed or not. Coverage, it's been submitted an index, mobile user agent, all that sort of stuff. If you're wanting to see that uh, more clearly, not alongside all the other data. If you go into this drop down search console, then we can see the data pretty straightforward. And then you can start to look where there's potential for your site within Screaming Frog. So if you click impressions, sort by the amount. So this is past 30 days. I can see which pages have got a ton of impressions, not many clicks, low average position. All that sort of stuff, URL is not in, on Google. So if there are any landing pages, and there's all these filters as well. So there's clicks above zero, no search analytics data, orphan URLs. URL is on Google, but has issues. So I click URL is not on Google. If there are any pages here, which I do want to appear on Google, and there may well be some, then this is worth a look. Page is not mobile friendly, non indexable. Uh, but yeah, there's a, there's a ton of different options, but every screaming frog crawl I do nowadays has the Search Console API embedded in, and you can embed in J4 data, Universal Analytics, PageSpeed Insights, Majestic, Ahrefs, Well, that's just Search Console for now.